Hey guys, I'm still over here at the Goodwill and I found this thermometer barometer gizmo. It's really nice. I like the turquoise blue in it. And they want four bucks. I've got like a bunch of them. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Who are your maker? It's a Springfield Instrument Company. Hmm, maybe. It is nice. It's a nice little guy there. I'll take a little picture of you and think about it. Okay. Off I go. Hey guys, I'm out at another Goodwill and where am I? Hmm, I think I'm in Sarasota. Uh, check. It's a really super cool, uh, like a dock with a boat gizmo. Very cool. And for 13 bucks, that's definitely worth it. Wow. Very, very cool. Oh my goodness, check this out. <laughs> Look at this. Uh, it's just a print. <laughs> Blue Moon. I remember when that stuff first came out. I like it. It's not bad beer. What else we got over here? Skippy. Aww. Yeah, that's kind of cute. Not for me, though. And a little guitar. But that's that's pretty cool there. Anyway, off I go. Something's going to be around the corner, I hope. Beep. Hey, guys. I am still out at the Goodwill off of, um, and here in Sarasota. And this is a pair of Bernard prints. Uh, you can see the signature down there. Sorry about the glare, but they're really shiny. Uh, let's see if I can get that a little bit better. And see if I can take a picture. God, they're shiny. Oof, sorry about that. And take a picture and boop. <laughs> Maybe I can get it better there. Nope. Nope. Just won't do it. Oh well. Off I go. Hey guys, I'm out at the Goodwill over in Sarasota, off of Tamiani. Look at this thing, it's a freaking barrel. Barrel liquor cabinet. Somebody had a cool little idea. <laughs> Very cool. Take a picture, and I guess it's got, it's got a little mirror in there. A little banding and stuff on it. That's really pretty cool. 20 bucks too. Okay, that's pretty neat. Never seen that before. That's fun enough. <laughs> a barrel. Okay. And take another picture and off I go. Bye. <laughs> Guys, I just uh, found this at the Goodwill. Uh, they're unmarked. I've seen this pattern a couple times before. I'm not sure who it is. But it's definitely, it's the stuff that's really, really cool. I'll take a little picture of you guys. And I don't see a price on it anywhere. Yes, I'm getting this set of uh, colonies. <laughs> Very cool. Okay, off I go. Beep. Hey guys, uh, I'm still at Goodwill and I found, <laughs> check this out. It is, it's a colony set of, um, this is a mixer for martinis. And these are like little little black and white glasses. Sorry, I had a frame. And they went eight bucks for it. I just looked them up and then one of them sold a set just like this sold for a hundred and I think twenty and then I guess there's a couple other people have them out there for a hundred and fifty but I think I'll snag it for eight bucks and make a couple dollars off of it okay now I gotta load this up off I go beep hey guys I'm at a Goodwill again and I saw this look at this guy pretty cool with the faux bamboo frame and everything. Anyway, I think it's, yeah, 60 bucks they went for it, sorry. Uh, it's pretty cool, but it's got some damage. It's got some damage up around in there too. But he's worth a picture and a little video, so. Boop. Okay, pretty cool. And what's this, it's signed, uh, I'll take a picture of that and send it to you guys. It's very, very cheeky-ish, kind of. Okay, off I go. Beep. Guys, I'm out at um, well, I'm in where am I? Palmetto. Check out this. It's a freaking full-size mannequin with that faceless female form thing for 95 bucks. She is too damn cool. That is too cool. If I had the room, I'd get her. But I don't, so I won't. 
Oh, it's got the good face on it too. That's that's really pretty cool. Okay, off I go. Beep. Hey guys, I'm at a little thrift store over here in um, Palmetto. And look at this little thing. Very, very cute. Very cute. It's from 76. Dowel or whatever. That's really neat. Get a little picture. Sorry, it's got to go on the side. And okay, off I go. <laughs> Manatee Avenue and it's the Goodwill over here and back at home in Bradington and I found this super cool uh, teapot uh, kettle water kettle thing and it uh, I looked it up and I, I know I, I have seen these before and it's uh, one of them just sold for um, $40 on Etsy so I know it's I know it's a thing I think that's the signature there I'm not sure but um, yeah for four bucks or five bucks I'm getting that thing it's really cool it'll clean up and uh, I'll sell it. And let me take a picture on the side. Okay, back. Okay, off I go. Oh, hold on. There was this other cool one over here I had to show you. <laughs> it's like a little fish pot. I would've got it. It's five bucks, but it's got the bottom on. It's pretty messed up. It is really cute, cute with the whistler. And this one here with the whistler. It's a freaking whistle. <laughs> Very cool. Okay, and that's that, and off I go. Beep. Hey guys, it's me again. Uh, I have found a really cool can opener, electric guy. Clicky clicky. It is an old Sunbeam. You can't really see. It's got some. It's got some loss on the stuff over there. But it says Sunbeam, and I was I got it with the tester. So it looks like this thing is spinning. It is spinning. Damn cool, and they only want two dollars and fifty cents for it. So, uh, do a thing like this and take a little picture. I'll write it up. Very cool, very, very cool. Okay, two bucks, two fifty. I gotta get it. Oh, what's the back say? It is. I, I had a really cool Hoover one that I sold last year. <laughs> very cool stuff, and it's not damaged. I mean, it just has some, some, um, uh, uh, paint loss or whatever that stuff is. I might be able to find a thing and actually redo it. Yeah, for $2.50, it's pretty cool. Okay, off I go. Beep. Hey guys, I am still in the hospital thrift store and I found this vase. Uh, I'm guessing it's, I'm guessing it's German or something, but this thing is so freaking thick. It is so thick. God, look at that, it is really, really thick. And it's got, uh, over here, it's got a, I can't really, I guess it's an F, and something on it. But uh, that thing is just, oh, and it had a, had a little tag over here. I just don't know what it is, but that's a, oh my God, it's gotta weigh like 15 pounds. Oh my God, that thing's heavy. It's huge, heavy. That's one huge chunk of glass. Oh, wow, that is really very impressive. All right, let's take a picture of you and see if I find anything else. Off I go. Okay, guys, I'm still at the um, hospital thrift store off of um, Manatee. Look at this painting here. It's really weird. It's really weird. Or her, she's kind of spooky. <laughs> All right, now off I go. Over here at the, um, uh, the hospital store. Uh, the store, and check this out. <laughs> it's not it's or anything, but it's a cool little painting. <laughs> an octopus and the sun thing over there almost looks like a, a graffiti looking stuff. Anyway, it was worth a quick shot and take a picture, and off I go. just sitting down over here and there's this cool ottoman. You know, if it didn't have this scratch in it right here, I'd have got this damn thing. And it's just really pretty cool. I'll take a picture of you. I want five bucks for it. Oh, that sucks that that's in it. Uh, oh, and it's got a little bit of chew over here too. See the chew? And that's all. That's, this is what it is. You can see that's, that's true to what it is. 
I'm thinking it's got to be it's 50s or 60s, somewhere around there. That's just a neat little stool right there. Very cool. Okay. I'm waiting. There's a picture picture in the back room for some people to move out. I don't really like taking pictures of people or video or not. So, I'll be right back. Beep. right here oh I am still at the uh, my hospital fifth store this is it looked like it was a high low lamp for a second and it is not it's a little chewed up over there it is a bed uh, you put this in the back of your bed you tighten it down and uh, you can read your book or whatever you're doing for your puzzles or whatnot so that's pretty cool and they want uh, what is it uh, it was inspected I'll see a price for you See a price. Oh, oh, there it is. Two fifty, and that's there. Yeah, I'm sure it works just fine. I'm not plugging it in. It's just something light, so I'm guessing it's seventies probably. Anyway, take a little picture of you and get that in frame. And oh, and over here, it's this ghastly lamp, but the shade is that nubbly stuff. That's silk. I know it's the, it's the it's a nice one from the 50s. I'm pretty sure, maybe early, early 60s. Uh, the shades uh, the shades it, but the lamps or the base is pretty lame. Anyway, uh, off I go. Okay, guys, check this out. It is a vintage vinyl LP cleaner. And it's got the juice down inside of it, and it's for a buck. I've sold a couple of these over the last two years. I think I got like 10 or 12 bucks for them, but it's all there, and for a dollar, you can't say no. Yeah, dishwasher. Very cool. Off I go. Hey guys, right over here, the little glass from the past. Well, 80s it looks like to me anyway. Look at this little tiny TV. I thought that back in the day, I remember when they came out. Uh, I got so excited I wanted one, but I never got one. And they went 15 bucks for it. Oh, wow. A little General Electric, and I will take a picture of you. Uh, not getting it, but it's pretty cool. It's got a little radio and stuff in it. You used to be able to, you used to take that to the beach. Okay, off I go. Beep. Hey guys, we're still at the, um, the hospital food store, and I found this really cool flower, kind of like daisies, um, fondue pot. It's been used. It's got the this damage right here on the enamel. It was six dollars for it. I mean, it's got the chafer, it's got the pan on the bottom. And I was looking over here. It's never, it's never been used. I think it's just been knocked around. It's got the little Japan sticker on it. So uh, I know I'd get it. Actually, what I need is this thing right here. Or this other one that I have. Anyway, uh, I'll take a picture of it and. Uh, it didn't have that damage where I get it, but it is pretty cool. Flower power. Okay, off I go. Beep. Hey guys, I'm over here off of, where am I? I'm off of Manatee, and it is the hospital thrift store, and I found this really cool little ashtray. It looks like it's 50s, maybe 40s, but it's a um, really cool little cast iron bendy up thing with a neat little piece of glass in there. For four bucks, I'd almost get it, but uh, at least it's worth the picture. See if I can put it down there and get it flat. Ooh, there's an old, there's an old soldering iron here too. And um, there's some, oh, there's some uh, hummingbirds. And I will take a picture of that thing. It's kind of cool. Doot. Okay, maybe I'll find something else. Off I go. Hey guys, I'm looking over here at the pots and pans, and I found this really cool. I'm guessing it's like a seafood pot. Kind of, it's got a crab and it's got some mushrooms, mushrooms in the corn and carrots and I guess that's a beet, uh, onions, tomato and clams. And it's got a really cool look. That it's got that pant and yellow lid. It's really heavy duty. Eight bucks. I mean, it'd be, it'd be really cool. It's really heavy too. Uh, cool, but no cigar. Close enough though. It's worth a picture. Okay, and then right over here was this pot right here with a really super cool lid for five bucks. I'll take a picture of that. It's pretty cool. I've seen that before. And uh, oh, it's got to see who the maker is. Oh, it's made in Italy. Can't make out the thing on it. 
but I will take a picture and maybe you can figure it out. Dude! Oh, come on. There you go. Okay. Off I go. Beep! Hey guys, still out at GW and I found this outhouse music box gizmo thing. Uh, the little door was off on it and it works. Well, it did work a second ago. <laughs> I think it's going to open the door. Let me see if I can wind it. It's got a little guy in there too. Up. Want to open? Anyway, it looks like the guy, the guy opens and he's in there pissing, I guess, or whatever he's doing. Uh, it wants, to, I guess, it opens and closes, or not really. Eh, it was close, but if it worked, it could be a possible. Not for eight bucks, Jesus. Hell no. And it is a, uh, of course, it's upside down, like everything is. It is a Berkeley design, made in China, I'm sure. Okay, but I'll get a picture of the guy inside. Boop. Okay, off I go. Hey guys, I'm still at the Goodwill, and I found this cute little Holland girl. You know how I know it's that? Because right on the back it says, Holland with love. A little kissy face thing, and it's even got the little, uh, Kato Holland thing on it. That's really cute. Aw. Aw. Get the whole thing in frame. Take a picture again. She's cute. <laughs> oh, and I found these. I found some uh, cookie cutters or biscuit cutters or whatever. They call it cookie cutters. But there could be a really cool, like a, um, uh, uh, like a retro 60s flower, flower power thing. I'm gonna get them for three bucks. And then they sell for like, like 12 or 15. Anyway, off I go. Beep. Hey guys, I'm looking at this weird gooseneck thing. It's a, well, it's a lamp, table lamp. Table, lamp. I'm gonna date this around, it's gotta be 80s. Yeah, it's gotta be 80s and this is like, um, it's like that rattan wrap stuff. You know, it's not 80s. This thing's this thing's got to be 70s. With the work and still with this stuff, with the fittings and all that. Yeah, that's got to be 70s, maybe 60s. And this stuff over this thing over here, it's a composite material for that. I mean, I don't know, for 30 bucks, eh, it might work for somebody. Not for me, but I will get the gooseneck over here. Take a little picture. And you'll get a better idea. Okay, kind of in frame. Okay, interesting enough, but I'm not getting that. Off I go. Hey guys, I'm still out at the Goodwill, and I found this really cool, uh, it's like a felt thing. It's really well made. No, thank you. Maybe. This thing has me intrigued. And it has over here, they wanted $35 for it. And I'll take a little picture of that too. And it's from 77. And they want eight bucks for it. Almost. But it's very cute. It's a very cute thing. Okay. Anyway. Oh, what was that other thing red put out for me? I'm coming up. Oh, oh. Who is it? Who is it? It is radio stereo stuff. Oh, it's signed by somebody. I don't know what this is exactly, so I'll take a picture of you, and I'll see if I can figure it out later. Uh, radios, stereos, or something. It's got a guy and a girl, and oh, down in here, 24 out of 50. It's Oklahoma, uh, photographed by Dennis Wells, I guess it says. Very interesting, but I got a, I got a picture of the thing. Maybe I can get another match. I got too much glare on it. How much did they want for that? Yeah. Eight bucks. Maybe. Maybe. Off I go. Woo! 
Okay guys, right down, right down a little bit here, I'm just looking down and there's a really cool set of monkey pod salad set with uh, one, two, three, four, five, six bowls, salad bowls, and then the salad bowl, big salad bowls off, but it's got a big crack right there. That sucks. And the price wasn't bad, but if it didn't have that crack in it, I get it. Get like 50 bucks for it otherwise. Anyway, uh, nope. Ooh, you know what? Here's this other guy. Looks just like this thing I had gotten last year. Um, I think it's from like Papua New Guinea. I have a little witch doctor guy. It's made out of the same material and stuff. Uh, anyway, I'll take a little picture of you too. <laughs> okay, Boop. off I go. Something around the corner. Back into Goodwill and check this out. Boop. I was like doing a double take. Is it Hager or is it not Hager? And it has the glaze and everything and boop, it is Hager. I'm just not hot for the design on it. But for five dollars, five dollars, it's a possible maybe. Sorry, get it out of frame. And I'll pick it up there and take a picture. And take a picture of that. Whew. Okay, maybe, maybe not. Off I go.